Greetings faculty and welcome to another WIS Technology tutorial. In today's topic I'm going to be talking about using the smart board to mark up a website in your class. Now many of you have probably done this before where you've picked up the pen and you've just started writing on a website but there's a problem. Um, the minute you go to scroll you can notice that your markings do not go with the website. So there's a way around that. Um, I'm just going to clear that. Google Chrome has an extension called uh, Markup. And what you can do is add this to your browser. And this will allow you to mark up a web page and maintain the scrolling ability and send the marked up web page to your students. So let me just demonstrate it for you. But first, I need to be sure to turn off the Smart Ink. So I'm going to click here. I'm going to turn off the Smart Ink. Right? This is the layer that is on top of my browser. Now I'm going to click on the icon in the upper right, which is my Markup Chrome extension. And it's going to load a little menu in the upper right. And I have a very limited number of choices here. I have the thickness of the ink pen I'm going to use I can play with. I've got the color I can change. I can add a text box. And I have a variety of symbols, um, arrows, freehand, rectangle, circles, and lines. I'm just going to stick with the freehand to demonstrate how this works. Okay. So now with my SmartBoard pen in Google Chrome, I can begin to mark up areas of a website. I'm going to go ahead and just draw here an arrow to point to something that might be important. Um, maybe, maybe swap the color a bit to indicate some other aspects that are important. Go back to freehand. And now, I can actually go to the scrolling menu and scroll down and my markups stay with me. Um, now to get this website to oh, Victor. Hey Victor. Oh, hi. Um, <laughs> um, and I can now click the publishing button. Um, slide this over to the right to publish. It's going to give me a new URL which I can then copy and paste onto Moodle or send on via email, which is a link to my marked up website, um, of which my students could also add their comments and remarks to it as well. So this is how you mark up a web page using the Google Chrome extension markup. Um, it's a great way to mark up a web page um, and still be able to scroll. All right, thanks for watching.